Use Intermapper's WMI probes to get detailed information from Windows workstations and servers through the Windows Management Instrumentation Interface. Here's a closer look. All WMI probes require that Intermapper server is installed on a Windows machine with access to the target hosts, all of which must be running a version of Windows. Check each probe's description for system requirements. Use the CPU utilization probe to retrieve the percentage of time the processor is executing a non-idle thread on the target host and to alert you when it reaches specified thresholds. Use the Disk Available probe to determine the disk space available on a disk drive on the target host and to alert you when it reaches specified thresholds. Use the Disk Fragmentation Analysis probe to analyze disk fragmentation on a drive on the target host and to alert you when the disk needs to be defragmented. Use the Event Log probe to retrieve entries from the event logs on the target host and to alert you when an event matching the specified criteria is found. Use the File Check probe to get information about files on the target host using the parameters you specify. Use a name fragment, minimum file size, or specify a length of time since the file was created or modified to limit the search. If a file meets the criteria, the device goes critical. Use the Folder Check probe to get information about a folder on the target host. Set thresholds for the number of files, folders, or total file size. Use the free memory probe to determine the amount of physical memory available to processes running on the target host in megabytes and to alert you when it reaches specified thresholds. Use the installed software probe to retrieve information about software installed on the target host. Get a list of software installed using Windows Installer as well as the operating system name, version, and service pack level. Use the Logged On Users probe to retrieve a list of users logged on to the target host. Use the MS Exchange 2007 Hub Transport Server probe to get performance information about the delivery queues on a Microsoft Exchange 2007 Hub Transport Server. Set criteria to control when alerts are sent. Use the MS Exchange 2007 Mailbox Server Probe to get performance information about the delivery queues on an MS Exchange 2007 Mailbox Server. Set criteria to control when alerts are sent. Use the Network Utilization Probe to get information about network utilization on an interface on the target host. Set parameters to control when alerts are sent. Use the Process Monitor probe to get information about processes running on the target host. Enter process names in a comma-separated list. If any of the listed processes is not found, the state is set to critical. Use the Service Monitor probe to get the state of services running on the target host. Enter a comma-separated list of services. Status is set to critical if any of the specified services is not found and the missing services are listed. Use the SQL Server 2008 Service Monitor to check the state of Microsoft SQL Server 2008 services running on the target host. Check the services you want to monitor. Status goes to critical if any of the selected services is not running and their states are listed in the status window. Use the System Accessibility Probe to test accessibility of a target device from the monitored host. It tests the target device's connectivity and returns a chartable response time. If the target does not respond to a ping, status goes to critical and a discontinuity is inserted in the chart data. Use the System Information Probe to collect a variety of information about the monitored host, including hardware and operating system details. The device is set to down if there is no response. Use the Top Processes Probe to retrieve information about CPU utilization and processes running on the target host. The device status is set based on total CPU usage. Up to five high CPU processes are listed. That's WMI probes in a nutshell. Detailed information about each probe is available in the probe's description in the Set Probe window.